everybody. So we have the next Pop Sugar Must Have box. And Pop Sugar Must Have box is a monthly subscription box that covers trends and different uh, things that are popular, like in fashion, it has uh, accessories, and it has food sometimes, it has books sometimes, it just has a little bit of everything, which makes it really fun. So let's see what I got this month. Okay, the first item is from Jack and Lucy is the name of the company, and it is a hat. It's, uh, yeah, it's something different. I don't typically wear a hats, but I don't know, I think it's kind of fun. It's a little bit small for my head, but what do you think? Do you like the hat? <laughs> uh, put in the comment section if you like it. So, okay, then the next thing is from NCLA. This is a little manicure kit. It's nice. So we got everything that you need. So that will be good. And then we have, these are gluten-free bites, dark chocolate coconut. Not my favorite. It has no flavor. It is just completely like eating chalk. Oh, dairy-free, gluten-free, high-protein snacks. Uh, so why I don't like energy bars or things like that, that high, that, that synthetic protein is just always disgusting to me. So this is interesting. This is called Flint, the Retractable Refillable Lint Roller. Huh. Never heard of that. That will be nice in the winter for my coat. Okay, then we have a big, you do get all full size in Pop Sugar Must Have. This is Briogeo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. So that'll be really nice for my long hair. Definitely use that. The last thing from Smith and Colt, the Shining Lip Liquor. And this is a bright color like they always tend to do. So let's see. kind of weird. My lipstick is all like deformed at the top. So it's not as bright as I was thinking it would be. But I don't know, I still prefer the more neutral colors. But it looks fine. I'll, I'll, I'll use it. It feels pretty good. It's definitely like a thicker kind of lip gloss. So that is the Pop Sugar Must Have box. It's definitely, I, th I think it's a pretty good one. The only real miss is those horrible gluten-free coconut things. That was really gross. But I love the, I think the hat's fun. Try something different, and uh, which is the whole point of subscription boxes. And this nail kit is really cool. And I, I think the deep conditioning is really good. So, and the lint roller's different. I think I'll be able to use that. So overall, I think it's a pretty successful box. So let me know what you think. I'll have a link down if you want to check out Pop Sugar in the description section. And uh, thanks so much. Please subscribe to my channel, and I will talk to you later. Bye!